welcome to my channel if this is the first time that you are seeing all this goodness welcome for real you're probably gonna have the best time on youtube with me anyways i have not posted any video in two weeks guys two weeks and i'll tell you why so your girl went and got her tooth extracted i think i made some funny videos and i took some funny pictures maybe i would put them um i will slot some pictures while i'm talking anyway so i'm home like i'm in my parents house and my room is is a mess i can't even show you guys because i'm embarrassed honestly it's that bad like that's how bad it is so i'm just like you know what today's the day i'm going to bring out everything i'm going to try to start folding and just like put them away like my bag section is dusty my wig section like let me just even show you guys maybe you guys <sighs> please don't please judge me you guys see what i'm saying like everything is just so scattered like who does this and please don't judge my parents with the color choice of their house look okay you guys look at the dust here like that's how to tell you how long i've been in this you guys remember i told you i got a teeth extraction door you guys look at my teeth it still even has like dry blood on you ew oh my god it's so disgusting here yeah, i got two my teeth removed and i'm keeping it so my whole plan is to arrange everything before i go at least make it look you know presentable lay the bed just put everything in a nice order you get before i leave because i'm i'm going again today that's my plan so yeah you guys let's catch up what's been popping apart from my toothache to be honest because it made me useless i haven't been doing much although there's like really big news but like i can't tell you guys till i think maybe the next video that i will upload so that i can actually show and tell everything like in proper like you guys have to feel it. I don't know if you guys get me, but like, you guys have to be like, oh my God, babe, you go girl. That kind of energy, that's what I want. Hmm. There's some things I think I want to just dash out as well. That they're not exactly my style. Or oh, I've not worn in over six months. That's what I'm trying to use to clear things. So if I've not worn anything here in over six months, then it has to go, to be honest, because ugh, there's no space for nonsense. <laughs> yeah, that's what I would like to call it. Anyways, yeah. Uh, let me see. What should we even, guys, what should we even just about? This Big Brother whole thing. I don't know, this season, this is the first time that I'm not really into the old Big Brother, Big Brother. Like, I can't even recognize all of them. And that's so unlike me. Normally, like, I am a very ardent follower i know what's going on but like this time around i just don't care it's like oh i beg they are boring to me but maybe they will still be able to spice up things later who knows i don't know see these are dresses that i have to give out uh what else what else what else anything that i have not worn in a while to be honest it's time for it to go which one is this one again Ah, this top. Oh my god. See how it changed color. This is so sad. This used to be a very, very nice t shirt. But it looks weird to me now. Let me try fold it. I actually like this one, so I will not be giving it out. <laughs> I will not be giving this one out. I like it. And then, like, I have like a pile of books. I honestly cannot show you guys here maybe maybe should i i'm ashamed but you people will judge me like there's fear in my heart that i shall be judged let me just show you people so this is the mess i'm doing with this is the pile that i've started folding i just want to like fold everything put them where they should be maybe lay the bed you know this is even inspiration for me to actually just clear up everything like there's so much dust you guys see let me tell you there's a spirit that comes with unpacking. This is the box I took to Dubai in January and it has still been there. It literally has just been there. So yeah, I'm going to arrange everything today. This is like my, I can't see the dust. Can you guys see? Like I have not been here in so long. Yeah. So I'm going to get to it now. Yeah, so let's just, uh, there's this particular thing that has been on my mind since. And I'm just like, I want to air my opinion. So it's about this BBL thing. 
to be honest i won't even lie although yes bbl has kind of set a standard that is making women feel hold on let me reduce the brightness yeah making women feel a little bit uncomfortable with themselves and even the clothes they are now making now is literally like perfect for like bbl bodies and everything i'm not like i've never been against plastic surgery do whatever makes you happy bear the, um, the consequences as well everything is on you you i'm sure before you made such a decision you knew the pros and cons but like you cannot you can literally barely buy any clothes and they are not sewing it with maybe like the tiniest waist and we all know that not every woman is built in that way so like why does he have to, like why is that the standard of things like it's quite it's quite upsetting i don't know sha and then i don't know for some reason i i'm not i'm not a feminist i will say that to be honest i'm not like as if i don't care but like i'm not like a twitter crazy feminist that's the word i should use i guess like the way um men put their mouths in this type of things sometimes i'm just like are you a woman like what's your business like we don't come around and say oh do this oh do that like so like mind your business like don't put your mouth in uh, in in things about women's body you don't know women's body like women know their bodies do you guys get me so that's just how i feel about bbl people should drop in the comment section what do you think would you ever get a bbl if you can afford it to be honest be honest to think about it and be like mm, if i have the money today will i do it ask yourself because me i feel like if i have the money today not necessarily a bbl but i feel like i might consider doing a what they call this thing no? a liposuction because i don't go gym go gym go gym go gym i don't see results although i'm not i'm not the most consistent person i won't even lie but like if i have the money yeah i'll do it without even thinking ah you guys look at this dress it's been so long that I won't, it was when I was still working as an influencer for Jumia that I got this piece. Should I? I know that I won't really wear it. Yeah, let's see, go. There are some things that you just know inside your heart of heart that, yeah, I'm not gonna wear this again. And it's just time to let go. My sleeping socks, I don't need this anymore. This one. Okay. Let me just get to things, then I will just like maybe show you guys what's up as I'm sweeping and doing the other things. like crazy i already like the bed is done so i just have to clean my bags and the floor sweep mop and it's a shot so let me keep going so during lockdown i started reading a lot see this is waiting for god uh what's the name of this book point blank by Catherine gothia 1984 and, and i read a lot of books during this thing but like if you want any of these books you're seeing, please just let me know, to be honest. I don't think I'm going to keep them. There's no space for such. Anyways, let me just get to it. <laughs> Workout that I have not done in a while. See sweat. 
and see this thing of hoarding I, I feel like i'm going to actually stick where am i bending let me just carry the camera i'm going to stick to this rule of if i've not used anything in six months like taught it at all it's time for it to go this bag i'm even embarrassed to show you guys you guys look at i've not carried this bag in two years look at the dust on this thing look at the dust on this thing so of course maybe i'm going to okay you know what let's do a giveaway so if you want this the first person to like comment that they want it can get the bags because i feel like they've just been here for a while i'll clean them and show you guys what they look after this as well this is a very beautiful nine west bag i will clean it if you want it as well just send a dm or rather that was just, just in the dm just drop a comment and it will be yours uh this as well this is a very cute bag but i've not carried it in a while so yeah first people to drop the comments will get the bags let me just get back to my cleaning <laughs> I'll be giving this away. I'll be giving this away and I'll be giving this bag away. So three bags for giveaway. If you want any, just drop your comments and say I want and I will send it. Oh, please bear in mind. First of all, let me see this one. Delivery charges will be on you. Okay. But yeah, these three. And if I see any other thing, I will let you guys know. Anyways, this is the progress we're at. I'm still trying to finish up. After losing at least a hundred calories in sweat, I am finally done and I'm just going to show you guys what my room now looks like because I'm so proud of myself. This took me almost two hours, but I did it. Okay, I did it. Let me show you guys. Oh, no. your girl needs to go take a shower thank you guys for watching and helping me clean <sighs> let me just say this if you've not subscribed after this look at me burning all this sweat please 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 and please this please is even plenty but please make sure you subscribe before you end this video thank you guys for watching uh so please go and you know go and spam my old videos let me see your comments like why are you guys darling go and spam my old videos that's my favorite wig anyways these are the wigs that i wear like regularly so those are the ones out the other ones that i don't really wear those are not for giveaway you push like don't, don't get too excited anyways bye